everyone looking at ISIS, obviously, in this situation and the nature of it, but uh, does it look as though this was someone working very much on their own who wasn't part of a network? I believe today the lone wolf myth, which means a terrorist who set up an operation by himself, is a convenient one that doesn't really exist. Regarding the radicalization process, we are not certain today whether the perpetrator went through it, but he shows a certain number of signs of radicalization. But however, I don't believe in a lone wolf who decided one morning to get up, pick up a truck, and kill the greatest number of people he could. I think these people are indoctrinated, that they are part of networks, that they are in cells, that they are supported. What we want to know today is how we got here without being alerted by the French intelligence and surveillance services, who must be effective in monitoring these people.